So Bolton Saints is about reverse migration. It's a love story. It's about a family that wants to go home after 20 years of living in the American South, and they're gonna find that it's the hardest voyage of their life. Uh, it's about cultural resistance, because the question is, once you're here, how do you retain your roots, your traditions? But also, how do you manage living in two places at once? Because they're living physically in the South, right? but, but their minds are in their hometown, Sharan. So the film is about being in limbo. It's about yearning. And I think this yearning that we have to go back home is a yearning that every immigrant and migrant feels, but it's also, I think, a universal theme of yearning for one's home. I think also a great takeaway for Bulls and Saints is that it shows you that culture is everywhere. And we often think that, you know, folks come, you know, migrants come to the United States or, or they go to other countries and they might have a, a, a celebration here, a celebration there that, that often is watered down, that is often has one foot in assimilation and one foot in their home country or their home cultures. But when you look at the, these celebrations put on by the community of Chiran living in North Carolina, they are in Chiran, a place like Eastern North Carolina that has its own culture and it's very rich in culture and history in a little corner that you wouldn't even suspect there is an amazing cultural celebration going on that is beyond imagination.